Can I start by commending the committee for a fabulous report? But it is an actual shame that we ever got to have to having this report. I've just listened to Jane Dodds from the Liberal Democrats preach how bad this is for farmers, but if her party had stepped up in the last term of the Senate and supported farmers like Ply Cymru and us on the Conservative benches did, we would never ever be in this situation. So I find some of her comments quite hypocritical. But what I do want to talk about to the Minister, we do welcome some of the announcements that you have made, but it is around the additional 20 million and on recommendation three about the pressure this is going to put on our planning authorities. I do not believe, and nor do the industry, that this additional £20 million is going to help farmers to cope with these regulations when they come in with the infrastructure costs and everything associated with that. I've got a number of friends who are farmers who said that some of the money that you're making available won't even put the concrete in the ground to allow this to happen. So what I'd like to hear from the Minister, yes, additional money is welcomed, but we're going to have to see more investment because if you're asking farmers yet again to fork out more and more money, it's going to make farm businesses unviable and unsustainable going forward. And I'm sure we don't want to see these regulations driving our farmers from the land, producing food to keep our public fed and watered, because if we see our farmers leaving, our rural communities right across our country are going to die. And I know that's not something I don't want to see and my colleagues don't want to see here. So additional funding is welcomed, and I do hope that you put more money available to support the recommendations that you put forward. Thank you.